Nine-year-old girl is recovering tonight from a gunshot wound. It happened just outside her home in Ventura County, and she's not the only one hurt by that gunfire. It happened on the 400 block of West Ramona Street, and as officers investigated that attack, they received word of yet another victim, this time on the 300 block of West Park Row Avenue. News Channel 3's Tracy Laird joins us live from Ventura with the very latest on this. Tracy. CJ, at first police thought these were two separate shootings, but now they say that they happened in the same area of an apartment complex. However, the adult male who was shot ran home about half a block away. I'm on the Ventura Avenue, and this happened just down Ramona Street. A bullet grazed the leg of a nine-year-old girl walking near a downstairs apartment on West Ramona before four Tuesday afternoon. She couldn't walk unless she had a, she had a wrist tape, too. Well, yeah, it's pretty sad hearing that. I mean, I have a little sister, so I can see how that must have felt for their mom. Her mom looked pretty worried. Another bullet hit a man in the upper body. Multiple witnesses wishing to remain anonymous say they saw the shooter standing at the gate. They described him as a short, bald man with a 12-gauge shotgun. They say he was wearing white tennis shoes and got away in the back seat of a metallic car. Ventura police said the area is prone to violence, but not like this. So what's uncommon about this incident is that one that it occurred in the daytime and two it involved a, a victim that was a young child. Locals said they heard gunfire the night before too. The shooting didn't keep people indoors. They hope police will catch someone, but they worry if they talk, the shooter will be back. And the nine-year-old girl and the adult male were taken to Ventura County Medical Center. Ventura police have not released any updates on their conditions, but we do know that their injuries are not life-threatening. Anyone with information is urged to contact the Ventura PD. On the Ventura Avenue, Tracy Lair, News Channel 3. Okay, thank you, Tracy. In Ventura County.